Hi there everyone, uh, this is the video for the Java mini project. In this mini project we have done a hostel management system using Eclipse. So this is made by two members, uh, Prince and Joel, UR15CS173 and UR15CS177. So in this uh, project we are actually using the concepts of uh, control statements like switch, if else and uh, for loops and uh, we are also using the concept of uh, array of objects and uh, packages and uh, classes as well so in this we have created uh, two classes for hostel details that is hostel in which we have these attributes and uh, we have another uh, one for hostel details which is inventory which has uh, these uh, attributes and for student getting student details we have uh, three more classes so first one is uh, for getting student personal details and then we have room details of the student and then we have fees collection so in this we also calculate the fees of the uh, but each student and then we implement each of these classes uh, we import each of these uh, packages and the classes in this test uh, class and then we uh, we perform add details and uh, update details and display details for each hostel and as well as student. So now we will show you the output of this uh, program. So looking at the output, uh, so as you can see here, uh, we, have, we are getting some options here. First one is to add details, second is to update details, third is to display details and fourth is to exit. So here I am pressing one to add details and again there are two options to add, uh, it can be hostel details or student details. So I am again pressing one for uh, hostel details. Again, it is asking hostel name, student count, and room count. So I'm mentioning the hostel name, student count, and room count, as well as the number of beds, desks, sports goods, and damages. So again, if we want to add any details, we can add uh, like student details. So here I'm mentioning some uh, name, register number, and phone number. Likewise, some room number, room type, and hostel name and also mess name so if you uh, now we are going to see whether it's displaying or not so for that i have uh, pressed uh, three here so three is for display now to display hostel details i am pressing one so here you can see it's asking the name of the hostel so it, it will search in the uh, registry that whether uh, the name is present or not and uh, all the informations regarding those regarding the name will be uh, shown in the output so when when i uh, when i type hepsiba all the uh, details all the informations are shown in the output as you can see here and again when i want to display student details it's asking the register number of the student so I, in this management system, we can store as many as students as we want because we are using array of objects. So when I choose any register number, the all the information related to that register number will be uh, displayed in the output. So as you can see here, it's all displaying. So I, I, I already mentioned the register number, you are 15 CS 177. So all the information regarding that register number is shown. In the output so likewise if you want to update some details in the hostel details or student details you can update it with the option number two so when I go to update details here it's asking some choice uh, in the hostel details like to update the number of bed desk sports goods damage goods and student count so here I am updating a student count to 200 and again, I'm updating the student details. So for that, again, it's uh, asking the register number. And regarding the register number, we can uh, update any information 
so like i am updating here the mess name as it was earlier it was north and now i am updating it to it to south so again you can uh, display you can display and you can see all the changes that we have made in the uh, that we have made in the information uh, so you can see here 200 has been done for the student count it's had been it has been changed as well as for the mess you can see here south it's doing uh, it's uh, per, uh, working perfectly fine so like this you can uh, make a hostel management system uh, thank you for watching our video